Hello friends, in this video we shall see the use of match function in regular expression terminology. What does the function do? It, it, the function attempts to match what? The pattern into a string and using the flags. The flags we have seen which are the flags. So three parameters are needed for the match function pattern string flags by default flags are 0 pattern regular expression to be matched string the expression to be matched in the source string flags you can specify one or more than more, more than one flags by making a binary or so this is the pattern matching function now this match function returns a match object on success and none on failure. If it, if the match is successful, then it will return a match object and otherwise it will not return anything, it will be null. Match object methods are two, group and groups. Group carries a parameter num which is equal to 0 by default. This method returns an entire match. Whereas groups, this method returns all matching subgroups. That is the difference between the group and groups. So, we have an example. I will show it to you, see, show the result by running it so that we can, you know, verify the result of the match method. So, in this example, we will see how the match function in the RE module, you know, it works. So, import RE is a first statement and in which there is a match function. Now this match function is to be used to find out this pattern in this string. The string is defined as a line. Line is equal to this is our string. Cats are smarter than dogs. What pattern you are going to trying to find out? There is a word R before which this is a pattern three characters before S and five characters before SM. This is a group after R, this is a group before R. So obviously the match is found here and there are two, two subgroups, cats, smarter. So match object dot group is this. Groups will give you the tuple of the subgroups that are found, cats and smarter. This will be the tuple object groups one is this is the first group subgroup second subgroup so this is what you expect in the match function there are three you know arguments or parameters this is the pattern this is the string in which this pattern is to be found and these are the compilation flags re dot m stands for multiplying and re dot i stands for ignore case so let us see the result and find out whether the result matches our expectation or not. So there you see, this is what is obtained as a group, this is the tuple, this is the subgroup 1, subgroup 2. So this is how the match function in RE module is working.